The first rays of dawn paint the sky with hues of gold and crimson, revealing the majestic silhouette of Angkor Wat. This breathtaking sight sets the stage for our exploration of a civilization lost and found, a testament to human ingenuity and spiritual devotion. Join us as we journey through the ancient and mystical temples of Angkor, where every stone tells a story. Our journey begins at Angkor Wat, the crown jewel of the Khmer Empire. This iconic temple, a marvel of architectural symmetry, stands as a testament to the Khmer's mastery of stone and their deep spiritual beliefs. Observe the intricate carvings that adorn its walls, depicting scenes from Hindu epics and the celestial beings who inhabit the heavens. Angkor Wat's significance extends beyond its religious importance. It is a symbol of national pride, proudly displayed on the Cambodian flag. Its reflection shimmering in the surrounding moat evokes a sense of tranquility and wonder, a timeless masterpiece that continues to captivate the world. We venture into the heart of Angkor Thom, the great city, a sprawling metropolis enclosed within formidable walls. These defensive structures adorned with imposing gateways and enigmatic faces guarded the Khmer Empire's heart. Within its walls we find a treasure trove of temples, each with its unique charm and story. The Bayonne Temple with its enigmatic smiling faces beckons us to unravel its mysteries. Thimianakas, a pyramid-shaped temple, stands tall, whispering tales of royal ceremonies and ancient rituals. As we wander through the city's ruins, we can almost hear the echoes of a vibrant civilization, its legacy etched in stone. The Bayonne Temple, with its multitude of smiling faces carved into its towers, stands as one of Angkor's most enigmatic structures. Each face, serene and enigmatic, gazes out from the temple, their expressions both captivating and mysterious. The Bayan was built during the reign of Jayavarman VII, a king known for his devotion to Mahayana Buddhism. Some scholars believe the faces represent the Bodhisattva Avalokiteshvara, a symbol of compassion, while others see them as representations of the king himself, embodying the divine power of the ruler. Whatever their meaning, these enigmatic visages continue to fascinate visitors, inviting contemplation and wonder. Rising from the Cambodian plains, Pre-Rup Temple stands as a striking testament to the Khmer's architectural prowess. Its name, translating to turn the body, alludes to an ancient funerary ritual. The temple's structure, with its steep stairways and three tiers, symbolizes Mount Meru, the sacred mountain at the center of the Hindu cosmos. As the sun sets, casting long shadows across the temple, Pre-Rup takes on an ethereal quality, its sandstone bricks glowing with warm hues. It's easy to imagine the temple as a gateway to the heavens, a place where earthly concerns fade away in the presence of the divine. Emerging from the waters of a now dry reservoir, East Mabon stands as a lone sentinel, a memory of a time when it graced the center of a vast artificial lake. Built during the reign of Rajendra Varman II, this temple, dedicated to Shiva, showcases the architectural evolution of the Khmer Empire. The temple's three tiers, each adorned with sculptures of elephants, lions, and mythical creatures, represent the three levels of the Hindu cosmos. As we explore its chambers and corridors, we are transported back to a time when East Mabon stood as a symbol of royal power and spiritual devotion, an island of faith in a sea of earthly concerns. Known as the Citadel of Women, Bante Sre stands apart from other Angkor temples with its delicate beauty and intricate carvings. Constructed from pink sandstone, the temple glows with a warm radiance, its surfaces adorned with exquisite scenes from Hindu mythology. Dedicated to Shiva, Bante Sre is a masterpiece of miniature craftsmanship. Its pediments, lintels and walls are covered with carvings so intricate, they seem to defy the limits of human skill. As we marvel at these miniature wonders, we are reminded of the power of human imagination and the artistry that flourished within the Khmer Empire. Taprom offers a haunting glimpse into the power of nature to reclaim the works of man. Here, giant fig trees and strangler figs have enveloped the temple, their roots snaking through walls and towers, merging with the stone. This fusion of nature and architecture creates a surreal and captivating landscape. The temple's crumbling walls adorned with carvings half hidden by vegetation, whisper tales of a time when Taprom was a thriving monastery, a center of learning and spiritual practice. Today, it stands as a testament to the enduring force of nature and the fleeting nature of human endeavors. Bante Kade, the Citadel of Chambers, stands as a testament to the ebb and flow of religious beliefs within the Khmer Empire. Originally constructed as a Buddhist monastery, the temple later underwent transformations, incorporating elements of Hinduism. Its layout, with its concentric galleries and central sanctuary, reflects this evolving religious landscape. 
As we walk through its corridors we are reminded that faith is not static, but a dynamic force, constantly adapting and evolving over time. Banteke Day's weathered stones bear witness to these shifts, offering a glimpse into the spiritual journey of a civilization. Ta Som, a small but captivating temple welcomes us with a towering gateway adorned with the iconic giant face, a recurring motif in Angkor's architecture. This serene visage framed by foliage embodies the mystical allure of Angkor. The temple itself, though partially in ruins, retains its charm. Its central sanctuary, once housing a statue of Buddha, now stands open to the sky, offering a glimpse into the heavens. As we explore Ta Som, we are reminded that even in decay, beauty persists, whispering tales of a glorious past. Our journey culminates at Preya Khan, a sprawling temple complex whose name translates to Sacred Sword. The temple's extensive carvings offer a glimpse into the history of the Khmer Empire, depicting scenes of battles and religious ceremonies. Preya Khan was a strategic stronghold built by Jayavarman VII to commemorate his victory over the Chams. Its labyrinthine corridors and hidden chambers whisper tales of intrigue and power, transporting us back to a time of kings and warriors, of empires won and lost. As we stand amidst these ancient stones we are reminded of the enduring power of history, its stories etched into the very fabric of these temples. As the sun dips below the horizon, casting a golden glow over Angkor's temples, we are left with a profound sense of awe and wonder. These magnificent structures, testaments to human ingenuity and spiritual devotion, stand as a timeless legacy, inviting us to connect with a rich and vibrant past. Thank you for exploring the enchanting temples of Angkor with us. If you're inspired by these ancient wonders, don't forget to subscribe for more incredible journeys around the world.